Hi guys, Anatoly from Define Agile here again and today we're talking about three questions you can ask Scrum Master to understand if he or she is a good fit. Question number one, what was your worst day at work? You will tell me, Anatoly, how is it related to Scrum Master? Okay, let me explain. First of all, Scrum Master is a person who brings Agile into organization, usually helps organizations to transform to Agile. Scrum Master helps teams to transform, they process to transform. When you work with a change and transformation, you deal with lots of conflicts, change and stress. So a person doesn't have enough experience dealing with the high stress situations, it will, very, it will be very hard for this person to be successful at the job. So I find that people who tell me that they had a really bad time at work and then they were able to overcome it and they still love this work, those are the people that I want to see next to me working as Scrum Masters. If people didn't have any major stressful change related experience in their career yet, I might find that they don't have experience and not enough experience for them to join my team. Well, this was question number one. Question number two, I ask, and this is related actually to the video that I shot, I'll put the link somewhere in here, but the question is, tell me the difference between Kanban and Scrum and when you should use one or the other. You'll tell me again, Anatoly, why would Scrum Master know about Kanban? Or maybe you don't use Kanban at all, why do we care? And you care for the sole reason of that Scrum Master needs to be a well-rounded person who looks around and understands all the other frameworks that are there and make sure that Scrum Master can make an educated decision which one to choose. So if Scrum Master just always works in their small box of Scrum and not looking around, I don't think he's the right person. So the question number three, what was the change that you introduced to the team and how did you do that? So this is very important because Scrum Master comes to a team and often introduces lots of things that Scrum Master thinks is right. If you don't introduce them well, if you force something on people, you won't just work and then you won't have any good relationship with uh, your team. Scrum Master is there to support team, to advise things and good Scrum Master should be able to explain you how he, run, uh, how he made sure that everyone understood that the change is good and how he rallied people around the change and make sure that they implement in such a way that everyone is happy. This was my three questions. I usually ask every Scrum Master. Thanks a lot for watching. If you have any questions, please put them down below. I would love to know what questions do you ask in your Scrum Master interview. And if you want to, me to cover anything else, I'll be happy to as well. Thanks a lot for watching. Subscribe to this channel because a lot more stuff is coming in the following weeks. I appreciate you and see you soon. Bye bye.